What are you doing here, Melly? Muffy, eek! Elise! I, I, I'm doing nothing, nothing at all. Stuffing yourself full of Miss Lisbeth's apples again, are you? Oh, but they're really sweet, Elise. Keep your grubby hands off of me, Mindy. You, 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 you're lost. This girl, I wonder if she'll be all right. What time of day is it? Afternoon. Let's see if this is a new mini game. Content unavailable. Please purchase the full game to unlock. Oh, okay. Interesting. So was this saved before Leb Lebkirken or after? Oh, hold on. There's a new dialogue thing here. Elise, Elise! I'm busy. Shoo, shoo. You're so boring, Elise. No wonder you're always in such a bad mood, Elise. Puppy. Oh, I'll tell you who's always in a bad mood, you little... Please, Elise, come play with us. She won't. She's a coward. 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 Oh, this little shit. Oh, I'll show you the coward. Give me that. How did you do that, Elise? Oh, she's good. You did it from so far away, Elise. You're making too much of it, you brats. Your arms are longer, that's why. Cheater, you're a cheater. Why, you? <laughs> and they run off, of course. Oh, this is this is fun. I'm enjoying this. Uh, we can't really find that person who was around the well because everything's kind of like... Locked off at the moment. Because of all the uh, debris. I do want to explore some more dialogue options if I can, though. There you are, lassie. Oh, okay. Cool, cool. We can uh, try the opposite dialogue option this time for this lady. Here I am, Miss Wilma. But ah, blah. I just threw up in my mouth a bit. Ew. Ah, sorry about that. Ah, I have a acid reflux issue. Reflex, reflux, whatever. Anyways, it's chronic and I can't get rid of it, and it hurts a lot. Anyways. You've heard, I'm sure, about the windstorm, yes? Oh, to hell with that nonsense. I'm talking about the festival. What about it, Miss Wilma? My Elise, I didn't take you for a simpleton. What do you need, Miss Wilma? I would appreciate it if you didn't waste my time. My, don't get in a temper now. I need your help with the inn, is all. I've already talked to Freya. She'll be lending a hand as well. It'll go by faster with both of us, at least. Oh, don't be silly. You'll be cleaning up. I need Freya's eye for flowers. Gar for flower garlands. Why, you? You'd best be prepared to lend a hand, you hear? Ah! The fucking bitch. What an actual bitch. Oh, it's you. Elise, was it? What can I even buy from her? Oh, I can buy matches? Bandages, ointments, grape juice, St. Walpurga's oil. Okay. Are you sure that's all, sweetheart? Yeah, that's all. You should come by more often, darling. Well, that's... Interesting. Wait, did I go all the way down here? 
Oh, there is a sprint! Yo, there is a sprint! Okay. Oh, that's gonna make things so much easier now. Let's go. Woo! Did I go up this way? Yeah, I went up that way. I'm gonna go ahead and give the egg thing a try again. Let's try the egg mini game again. Ah, Elise, are you busy today, I wonder? Do you need anything, Miss Linda? I was hoping you could collect some eggs for me if you have the time. I've been lending a hand in the alleys, you see. Of course, Miss Linda. It's no trouble, I can fetch you a few. Oh, thank you, Elise. Careful not to get pecked, you hear? <laughs> Let's go get these eggs from these broody hens. Because they're brooding. Chicken frenzy! Chicken frenzy! Hell yeah. Alright, here we go. Damn it. Oh my god. Oh, come on. Oh. I'm on round two. Okay. Damn it. Damn. I'm getting a lot now. Ow. Damn it. Alright, let's see how many I got. I feel like I got a lot more that time. I got 30! Rank B! Woo! I'm getting better! Hell yeah. I'm good for now. That is a really cool minigame. I fucking love it. You pass. I could have done with a few more, but I suppose these will do. A few more? No, that's alright. Here you go, Elise. God, how many do they want? How many eggs can these folks eat in one sitting? <laughs> Alrighty then. Let's see what happens if I just stay... Is that guy... Oh, I thought he was pissing. Let me talk to this guy. Still running about town, I see. Oh, it's Gustav. As I do, Miss Goose, Mr. Gustav, weighs me down seeing you that hard at work on Sunday. Why don't you come for dinner one of these days? Oh, I wouldn't want to impose. Freya would be jumping for joy, you know that. I'm grateful for the invitation, truly, but I have uh, some soup, some soup spoiling sometime tomorrow, you see? <laughs> Freya talks about you day and night. I can see your close friends. Oh, that's... Whatever reason, Elise. You're always welcome in our home, you hear? Thank you so much, Mr. Gustav. It's only a matter of time until Freya brings you around, you see, you'll see. So Freya's just been, like, risen me up this whole time? Who's this lady? Why, Elise, you don't mean to tell me you're still working. I don't have much of a choice, Miss Brunhilde. Why, that can't be good for you. You're too yielding, Brunhilde. Oh, I can't help it with a baby on the way. Oh, she's preggers. Those are some enviable worries, Brunhilde. 
enviable Miss Irene. Oh, it's nothing worth mentioning. Moving back to the Primeldorf may... Oh, moving back to Primeldorf may very well be our only option, sadly. It's only a matter of time, Brunhilde. Geffelberg's no longer has much to offer. I left Primfeldorf behind for my husband, but you won't be staying for long either, will you, Elise? Elise is too self-driven for Kiffelberg. Always has been. Ah, uh, I suppose. I wonder if this, like, affects dialogue, like your, your food level. That's really interesting. Well, these, these fuckers are gonna make me work. I guess I could do it. Oh, it was absolutely horrifying. What happened, Miss Wilma? Those dreadful branches inside my shed. I hear nothing of branches reaching the inn. They didn't last. It's a mystery as to someone or something left a... Oh, I one wouldn't even know what to call it. Rather sin sinister, isn't it? It could be that it's coming from the woodland. Elise! Why don't you say that, Elise? Why, why do you say that, Elise? No reason. I'm simply going by what others have been saying, Miss Ludwig. Mr. Ludwig. It was you. Oh, I just know it. Huh? Come now, Wilma. We can't be saying such perilous things. Truly, but I still ought to say, if there's anything you know, Elise. Oh, for goodness sake. I'm done talking to you lot. Elise! What the fuck? Oh, fuck this cow. I hate the inn owner so much. I actually hate the inn owner. Oh, I didn't mean to go down that way. I suppose I should um, re-explore the dialogue options then. For that. What the fuck? Why is this guy just hanging out by a tree? What are you doing, Apple? Shh, look. Wilma's losing her wits. Losing her wits. It worked. We did it, Elise. What worked, Apple? Jacob and I hit a bunch of those branches in her shed. That's your prank? Why don't you come up with a better idea then? I'm not the one who wanted to prank Wilma, Wil Wilma to begin with. You're just as giddy about it as we are. We were, you liar. Was not. Were too. I'll tell Miss Wilma you pranked her. I'll tell Wilma you pranked her if you do. Why, you? What a little dick. What an actual asshole. Oh, that's a mini game I can't do yet. Okay, let's see if we can, um... I guess we should continue Lebkirken? I thought you'd be holed up in some church all day, Leb. I'm waiting for Miss Audley. She asked me to pray the rosary with... Pray the rosary with her outside. Says she needs blessings after lending a hand in the alleys. Lending a hand? What's she doing out there? Rittering on about the witch. So I'm told, yes. You put up with too much of this nonsense, Leb. You know my answer to that, Elise. It's my duty to play make-believe with Miss Audley all day. You wouldn't understand. Elise! You'll have me fretting over you at this rate, you know. Aren't you already no more than you fret over me? 
unnecessarily, I'll add. Speaking of Miss Audley, she's rather late. I can't keep your company until she comes. Bleh, excuse me. I can keep your company until she comes about Leb. My goodness. Deed for today. My good deed for today. I have a better idea for your good deed of the day, Elise. Moving along to work on and stop wasting my time. <laughs> Go on now. I'll be seeing you later. I'll see you. I can't talk to the father, apparently. Oh! I need to have a word with you, Elise. Has come to my attention, you went home rather late yesterday. Oh, for goodness sake. Bernhard and Ludwig are quite concerned about you. My apologies, father, but it wasn't just my own fault. Whose fault was it then, would you say? Miss Elma's, obviously. She kept me working until nightfall, as you know. Hithelberg has no need for conflict. The town is tense enough as it is. Tense about what? The witch? You oughta to make light of it, Elise. Oh, you oughtn't make... Oh, fuck. I hate old-timey talk. You oughtn't to make light of it, Elise. Less miss... Lest Miss Audley spontaneously catches on fire, I know. How could such a thing happen? It was a manner of speech, Father. A rather crude one, even for you, Elise. Oh, for goodness sakes. I don't have time for this. Oh, shit, so they'll... You can get the whole town thinking you're the witch? God damn, that's kind of fucked up. Looking after the flowers, are you? Ah, uh, Elise, Mama... Okay, we already read this. What's going on up here? Oh, it's that. Wait, hold on a second. Oh, that was just a regular goat. They're so cute! All right, let's go this way. Who's this lady again? Oh, it's Freya. Ah, Elise. I thought you would, you'd be in town. Oh, I just stopped to pay Miss Gretel a visit. She's been wanting to teach me this recipe, but I can't seem to find the time. A recipe for what? Oh, I'm so glad you asked, Elise. You see, Papa's a big fan of. Her, her honey milk bread, but Mr. Gustav? He's got the biggest sweet tooth, you know? Now that's a little unexpected. I've been meaning to learn the recipe is all. Why not get it from Miss Gretel's? Ah, it's a little embarrassing, but Papa, well, he's always said that, um, you don't have to tell me, Freya. He says he likes my cooking better because it's, um, made with love. Okay, well, I think he's just saying that because you're his fucking child. Oh, I know, Elise. He's so embarrassing. Yeah, she's got daddy issues. Can I go up here? Can I- Oh, shit. Bro, I just stole pretzels from the bakery. Ah, it's a little old lady. It's a little old lady. She's just a little old lady. Looking cheeky again today, dearie. Yeah. See ya, Granny. Wait, could I sell her her own pretzels? Hold on, let's see. Lamau? <laughs> I just sold her her own pretzels. Bro, I'm gaslighting this old lady. <laughs> no, no, it's okay. You bought your own pretzels. It's fine. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, let us continue. 
back home, I suppose. Can we even go this way yet? I'd, be, I'd best not wander about too far. Oh, there's a castle up there. I bet we can get to that castle. Well, maybe I should see if there's another dialogue op option for anything else while I'm at it here. Before I move on to the, uh, the other place. Mr. Gustav and Freya really are close, huh? Can't say it's not understandable, though. Oh yeah, I can run. Fuck, I forgot about that. Um, I actually think I'm going to reload because I want to see that other dialogue option. I'm going to be doing this so much, aren't I? <laughs> Oh man, I'm gonna have so many multiple saves.